When a big name like Barack Obama visits your city, it's easy to get caught up in the glamour of it all. And there was this kind of this little air of excitement that was going on, and that uh, filters over into the police officers too. But what you may not know is that those visits are paid for by you, the taxpayer. It is costly uh, because we do have to obviously put people to work at it over time to uh, cover everything. Because Toledo is a political hotspot, the city does work possible campaign stops into their budget. But should we be responsible for paying someone else's costs? I think that uh, anything politics-wise should be paid for by the politicians, by their donations, by their, the people supporting them. Those costs are, in large part, due to the amped up police presence and overtime costs. Officers for crowd control, street closures, surveillance, undercover, often with minimal notice. While it's stressful in that we have to do a lot in a short period of time, uh, we have the experience and know how to handle it. But to an already cash-strapped city, the money could be put to better use. Considering we had a problem even hiring any police officers and fire department uh, just a few years ago that we probably shouldn't be spending the extra money on things like that. But before you get upset with the city, remember that it's the duty of our civil servants to protect our highest civil servant. Or is that the job of the Secret Service? Well, as far as some citizens are concerned, we pay our bills. Visitors, politicians or otherwise, should do the same. They don't have any problem sending us a bill for things. We shouldn't have any problem to send them a bill for the same things.